Once I show you this technique, you will not believe just how simple and straightforward it is to tie an aqua balloon. Hi, I'm Melanie from Balloon Artworks and I'm a full-time balloon artist here in Derbyshire in the East Midlands. Over the last 12 months or so, I've been using the aqua balloons a lot. I really do love this product. They are so versatile and so very beautiful. Their transparency and clarity and brilliance, there's nothing to rival them. Even the new clears, they're not as clear and transparent as these aqua balloons. And for that reason, I use a lot of them and my clients absolutely love them. I'm going to show you how to tie your aqua balloon. The technique we use to tie the aqua balloon is very, very different to how you would tie a deco bubble, where you would use a 160, wrapping it round one way around the neck of the, the deco bubble and then swapping over and going the other way five or six times and then tying in a knot. And it can get quite exhausting, particularly if you've got rather a lot to do. And the aqua balloon is so very, very simple to tie off. If you can tie a latex balloon, you can tie an aqua balloon. We do it in exactly the same way. And I'm going to show you my tying technique right now. The great thing about the aqua balloon is its stretchiness, its elasticity. So there's a lot of give and stretch in this neck. And what we can do is we can just tie it exactly the way we would a latex balloon. And the way I do that is I get hold of the neck, I pull it, I stretch it, I stretch it over my two fingers there and I grab the, uh, the, the end of that and I just pull it through and that's it. And that is how you tie an aqua balloon. It really is that straightforward and it doesn't matter whether you're tying a tiny one like this or whether you're tying the largest size that you've inflated to 31 inches or 80 centimeters. The way of tying is exactly the same. It's just as you would tie for a latex balloon. I really hope you found this video helpful and that you've enjoyed it. Please make sure that you give the video a thumbs up and that you subscribe to my channel. I will be bringing out more tips and techniques for aqua bubbles and other decor ideas and tips. I got a great reaction to my video, how to inflate an aqua balloon with helium. So if you're struggling with that right now, make sure you head over to my uh, video. I'll put a link in the description below where to find that video. I brought out a series of training videos just for the aqua balloons fairly recently. So that's aqua balloon techniques. Those videos are available online to download via my website. They're only £37.50, which is um, under $50. Um, and there are 17 videos, a series of 17 fairly short videos ranging from the, about three minutes, typically between three and seven or eight minutes. There is a longer one of 16 minutes and that's for one of the, the more involved techniques. But I've got so much on there. If you're wanting to learn how to use confetti, with your aqua balloons. I show you different ways to use confetti with your aqua balloons, different ways to create snow effects, how to use vinyl and put lights onto your aqua balloons, and how to create special effects. So if you want to create the illusion that something is floating within your aqua balloon bubble, how do you do that? That's all included in my training videos. So, so. Please do leave me a comment in the comments section below. Let me know what you think of this video and what are your challenges? What challenges are you facing with these aqua balloons at the moment? I'm very interested to know. You're very welcome to join me in Balloon Artworks Academy. That's my closed Facebook group. If you want to ask me any questions about this video or any of my other videos. And I'll see you again in the next video.